Welcome back everybody, this is Eric here and we're going to be making our Man Can announcement today for October. Uh, for those of you that don't know, Man Cans is an opportunity that we put out there for folks to basically sort of purchase a product that contributes to the overall health of our channel, helps us put out engaging, fun content, basically contributes to the channel and it's basically a box that goes into a certain category each month and you get it in the mail the next month and it's a bunch of cool stuff, merchandise and other things. Most of it's custom items, in case you don't know. Uh, but October is EDC month. We know that it's getting cold, people are about to start breaking out the jackets. Everybody carries during the summer too, but a lot of people carry during the winter a lot. Because let's face it, we have jackets, we have extra pockets when we wear like cargo pants. So we're always stuffing all kind of random stuff into our pockets to carry with us when winter comes around. Most of us generally carry a bigger gun uh, during the winter. I know I fall into that category. That's usually when I dust off like the full size Glock uh, Model 17 or, uh, you know, Strike One or something like that. You know, I, I dust off the larger gun to carry uh, during the winter when I'm wearing a, a coat or something. And I generally carry more magazines uh, with me during the winter time because I usually have some kind of coat to cover things up. So October is EDC month. Get them while you can. I have a very strong feeling that this can is not going to stay around very long. We're only doing 1,500 units, trying to keep it very exclusive and very small for now. Uh, we've been getting a lot of requests from you guys to make uh, the cans kind of encompass more units, okay? But right now, we're going we're gonna to keep it around 1,500 because that's a very easy amount for us to manage. And plus, when they sell out quick, people go, oh, dang, you know, I missed it. And it kind of builds up that suspense. So that's kind of what we're going for there. Um, so anyway, uh, with man cans, it's been going along really, you know, great. We're, we're learning a lot and we're getting a lot of feedback from you guys in terms of what you're liking and what you want to see. So uh, we appreciate the feedback, good and bad, because that allows us to make this uh, product better and better. So uh, September was shotgun month. Uh, we knew that a lot of people would probably, you know, be using shotguns for hunting. Uh, we just thought they'd be appropriate to make, uh, you know, that month a shotgun month. So I'm going to go ahead and unbox shotgun month. Now, at the time of this video, which today's the 15th, that's normally when we uh, announce this, you know, particular videos on the 15th of every month. Um, you know, these cans at the time that you watch this video have not been sent out yet. Uh, there's still going to be a few more days uh, before they get out in the mail, but, you know, this is, a t this is a sort of a, uh, a warning that I'm giving you guys here that this is a spoiler alert. So if you're wanting to be surprised, you might not want to watch this part of the video. So we're going to go ahead and break open um, September. Now, I felt like this particular can came along really well. I feel like the, the items in this can were like a home run. I really do. I, I'm excited to get this in your hands. So what we did is we got with, uh, I do have a sheet, cheat sheet, a sheet cheat, a cheat sheet. I have a cheat sheet, all right, and we're going to go down the line here. Always some silliness in these videos here. All right, so a custom fight soap. Um, guys, the Combat Hygiene puts out their fight soap, and we do a custom fight soap every single month. So for October can, definitely expect a fight soap. And, of course, each month we do a custom one. The logo's got the little IV-88, 88 head stamps on the 12-gauge rounds. That was Brandy's idea. I thought that was really fun. It's a manly scent. I'm not going to give it away. I'm going to let you be surprised. But let's just say it, it's definitely got hints of like vanilla, la maybe some lavender I'm detecting in there, maybe clover. And uh, it's kind of got that, that manly old leather kind of smell. I think that's what they were going for there. I like it. All right. So Bastion, we did a... Now, this is not how they come packaged, but I went ahead and took it out of here just so I could show you guys. We did a 12-gauge boar snake from Bastion. And this thing's really high quality. I was taking this thing and like ripping on it and pulling on it. Very high quality boar snake. In case you guys don't know what a boar snake is used for, let's say you're out hunting or you're out in the field and you've just shot a whole lot and you've got a bunch of wadding fouling in the lead of your shotgun barrel and you don't want to take the whole thing apart and rot it out right there at the range. You can take yourself a boar snake and drop it in from the chamber end through the front of the barrel and this gets pulled forward through the action. It has a brush built into it. So you've got your brushes right here, and then the swab fits tight, and it pulls everything through the front of the bore, out the front, where all the carbon and other crap goes when it leaves your barrel. What I do with a bore snake, this is just kind of a little tip you can do when you get it. You can take like an old tube sock. Um, if you guys ever have like, you know, that sock that mysteriously just goes missing, 
uh, in your dryer and you end up with a, a random sock that you don't know where the other one is, don't throw it away. Take that sock and tie it to this loop and it'll provide another bit of squeegee action for the length of that tube sock. Especially if you're like me, you know, I end up having like some of those really thick tube socks like you wear in the winter time. Those are perfect to tie on the end of these boar snakes. So we did a, a boar snake from Bastion. I thought that was really awesome. Uh, Bastion also stepped forward and did a custom patch. Uh, now this particular patch is awesome. Uh, we came up with a, with a fake National Boomstick Association. So that's shotgun related. You got some, you got some eagles with shotguns, a Benelli M4. It's green. I like that. I thought that was fun. So guys, from now on, every single man cam will have, moving forward, it will have a custom patch and a custom fight soap. Some of you guys have, you know, sent us some emails saying, hey, I'm not crazy about the soap, I'm not crazy about the patch, blah, 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 whatever. We, we've taken those comments to heart, but the bottom line is, is we've gotten enough positive feedback from the people that love the soaps and that love the patch to where we definitely have to keep that going. I think we would make more people angry than we would please, so we kind of have to make that executive decision there. One bit of advice that I would have there is if some of you guys, like, like let's say you get a fight soap, okay, and you don't like fight soap. Say you don't like soap. You don't need it. If you put this sucker on eBay and sell it, I promise you, if, if it's something you're not into, there's some collector out there that want, th these things are highly collectible. Just, you know, something to think about. All right, we also did a custom I Iraq veteran sticker that's going to go in this can, but I'm not going to show it to you. I'm going to make you wait. It's going to be a surprise. You'll love it, though, and it's shotgun related. All right, the gun socks from Sack Ups. Okay, so this company called Sack Ups, uh, they make these gun socks for shotguns. I mean, you can put a rifle in them, too, I guess, but it's mainly intended for a shotgun. And I know you guys have seen these socks before because... Like your big box uh, stores like Midway USA, Sportsman's Guide, uh, pretty much any of your online big box stores always has like their version of this gun stock. Uh, so the owner contacted me wanting to know if we wanted to put our logo on them. And I thought that was really cool to have the Iraq Veteran logo on the gun stock. So, you know, you've gone out and you've shot your shotgun, you've cleaned it with your boar snake, you can put it in here to protect it, put it back in your truck to go home or whatever you're going to do. It also comes with like a little oil wipe. This is like a bit of like extra material left over that they impregnate with a bunch of oil and that allows you to wipe down your gun and put it back in the sock. Uh, these things retail for like 15 bucks. Okay, so right now like the boar snake, they retail for like 20. You got 15 bucks in this. Fight soaps are around 10. Good quality PVC patch is around, you know, 8 or 10 bucks. So I kind of try to go off like the, the practical value of the items and I try to look at the practical use of the items that go in the can. And that's what we, we, we go to when it comes to deciding what we put in the can. So what I did is I, I figured since you were cleaning your gun and then you're putting it in a, in a, in a gun sock, an a, a zoom snap cap. These are made by Lyman. Uh, these are excellent snap caps. This is pretty much what we use exclusively up at the shop at Moss. We got this humongous bin of different snap caps so that when we're doing gunsmithing work, if we need to determine, okay, a magazine's not feeding right, or a firing pin strike is light and it's not, not sounding right, like the gun doesn't sound right, or we're doing an action job and we need to see how much we've improved the action without having to go outside and load live ammo in the gun, a snap cap allows you to safely cycle and dry fire your firearms and it protects your firing pins from damage, especially if you guys have like an old uh, over and under or a side-by-side -side, uh, Damascus twist steel gun. A lot of those guns have pretty soft firing pins in them. If you're not careful, you can definitely make them brittle. You can snap them. A snap cap allows you to safely dry fire your shotgun without worrying about causing damage to the shotgun. Okay, uh, These things retail for like you know, four or five bucks a piece, so not a terribly expensive item. But for this lineup, I felt like it was really important to have that in the can. It kind of embraced the thing quite well. Uh, there's one other item from U.S. Law Shield that we're going to put in the box. I'm not even going to show it to you. It's just a, a nice little thank you that they put in there. Uh, they've gotten a lot of good feedback about, from U.S. Law Shield in terms of getting people signing up. Uh, they are a gun rights you know, carry advocacy group and just a great bunch of people that will defend you and protect you if you're involved in a legal shooting. So they included another item for Mancan. 
not going to show you because it's, you know, it's just a small item just to say thank you. And uh, that's pretty much it for this can. So the main, the main big items, you know, there's going to be like other things that we throw in there that are extras. But from now on, I made up my mind that I'm not really going to show off the extras because some people get confused. Some people see like stickers in there and other little things like that. And they think, OK, well, what is this? You didn't do the video on it. Or what is this? You didn't talk about it. I think that it's important, like, if I've got extra stickers, what, what that comes from, just to explain it. I put those stickers in there, like, okay, one guy was asking, like, well, why is there a Mosin sticker in Patriotism Month? Or why is there a random Iraq veteran sticker that's pink for this particular month? So why is that in there? Well, the reason is because they're extra, and we just throw them in there, and we get them out to you guys, you know, just to, just to give them a home, okay? So that's why. So expect always something extra that you don't see in this video, and that's what we do. So boar snake, highly useful. Gun sock, highly useful. All right, patch, awesome. Put that on your jacket, your patch wall. Some of you guys are patch collectors. Snap cap, fight soap. I felt like that embraced the shotgun theme quite well. So don't go yet, though. There's some interesting things. So I want to announce that for October, we're also doing 100 limited edition breast cancer awareness cans. All right, so we're gonna have 100 custom fight soaps made. All the items in the box are gonna be like breast cancer pink theme. 100% of the proceeds are going to breast cancer research. So we're doing only 100 cans. So if you're wanting a breast cancer, a breast cancer can, order it as quickly as you can because they are going to disappear, okay? So make sure you, you check for that breast cancer can. 100% of the proceeds go into breast cancer research. And guys, remember, breast cancer is not just a female thing. Men get breast cancer too. Okay, so it, 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 a lot of folks have struggled with breast cancer, and we want to make sure that we kind of pay forward that awareness. You know, I've got family members that have passed from breast cancer, and uh, it's, it's a very touchy subject for a lot of us. And I know a lot of you watching might have lost family members to breast cancer. So we wanted to make a special breast cancer can. So I'm just putting that out there. Make sure you check the website. So you got your EDC month for October. You got your breast cancer awareness, limited edition can we're doing for October. There's your shotgun content. So special prizes. All right. I've got t-shirt sizes for a lot of you guys. So I don't have a lot of these left, but Savage was nice enough to give me a bunch of Savage t-shirts when I went to uh, NRA, they gave me some really neat Savage t-shirts, okay? I'm not including these in terms of like when you buy the can. These are extras. This is a special item that I can't give everybody. I'm giving away literally as many of these t-shirts in addition to the contents of this can that I possibly can. I think Brandy ran the numbers and we've got like a lot of t-shirt sizes. So believe me, as many of these shirts as I can get out to you guys, I'm gonna continue over the next several months to push those on out the door. I've got a good bit of them that Savage was nice enough to give me. So I want to say special thanks to Savage. They did not have to do that. And guys, that benefits y'all. I mean, they gave those to me specifically to give to you guys. So I thought that was really awesome of them. And I want to say thank you to them. Also, you guys remember when we did Love Your Gun Month? I, I believe it was Love Your Gun Month when we did the cleaning kits. Okay. Uh, I bought a whole bunch of cleaning kits for that month. And you might notice that, you know, some of them were like different calibers and stuff like that. So I ended up buying a bunch of shotgun cleaning kits. Now, I didn't buy enough units to give everyone one, but I bought enough units to where I can probably give about a third of you guys one of these shotgun cleaning kits in addition to your normal man can. So if you get a box in the mail that's not a normal size box and it's kind of long and skinny like this, then you won one of these clean bore shotgun kits. And guys, this is an awesome cleaning kit. I mean, these things retail for you know, like 20 bucks. I mean, when you look at the, the, you know, I guess the relevance of the cost of this can, that is kind of my goal to make sure that the contents of the can embrace the theme, that they're a good value, that you get something good for your money, and that allows you guys to help support the channel and, and help us continue doing what we're doing. So it's the support of man cans that allows us you know, to do what we do, to take on these big projects, to melt down guns, to blow up stormtroopers uh, with a Tavor, to ride around on a Polaris and shoot targets, 
you know, all of those videos are awesome. They're fun to make. And I wouldn't be able to afford to do that kind of fun stuff if it were not for the support of Man Can. So if, if you love this YouTube channel and you enjoy consuming this content, when you purchase a Man Can, you're, you're really helping out all your other brothers too that they might not have bought a can, but they're, they're getting the benefits of you buying that can as well. So everyone wins because you guys get the content, you know, we get the product out to you that's personalized. And that's a way that I feel we can kind of give back to you guys and it's a give and take. Instead of saying, hey, I want donations or hey, can you send in donations? This is a way that we can give something back to you and it's personal. It's from us, my family. So I, I love it. I love what we've been doing with man cans and we've learned a lot um, moving forward. I know some of the early cans, some people had some constructive criticism. We applied that constructive criticism and we've tried to make them better and better. So guys, there's about a 50 or 60% chance that you're going to get either a t-shirt or a shotgun cleaning kit in addition to the normal contents of the man can. So that's stuff that I just wanted to push out. We're getting towards the end of the year. I just you know, thought that would be fun. So stay for, uh, looking forward to EDC month in October. Um, we're going to have a lot of awesome products coming out in that can. It's supposed to be a mystery, so it is a mystery, but it'll all be practical things that you can use, things that uh, you know I think are going to be highly collectible and fun to have and everything. And don't forget about the breast cancer awareness uh, man can. There's only 100. So remember, only 100 of the breast cancer cans. They won't be around very long. So uh, thank you so much for the support. I uh, appreciate you giving me a little bit of your time this evening to explain you know, how this whole thing works. Um, if you've bought man cans before, thank you so much. Uh, if you're considering buying a man can, thank you for the consideration. Uh, it does help us you know, move along. Oh, and I forgot one last thing before I let you go. And if you watch this far in the video, uh, you, you need to know this for sure. If you bought a Shotgun Month can, one of you is getting an awesome, awesome, awesome item that's worth like 600 bucks. I can't tell you what it is. It's a surprise. But if you win it, all I ask, I want you to take a picture with it. I want you to take a picture with it and put it up on social media with a big smile and just say, thanks. All right, so guys, thank you for the support. We'll catch you next time. Much more content on the way. A lot of stuff coming down the pipeline. We're, we can't wait to get some of this uh, content put out. We've been working very hard and, and, and very diligently to make sure this content gets put out in a timely manner and it hits you guys and it's pertinent and fun. So thank you again, not to, to drag on, but we'll catch you next time.